The key thought for this section is to learn to move the club head rather than thinking too much about the way your body moves. And what we're interested in is the club face and the club head. Now, what I'm trying to do is to swing the club head through impact from here to there. And I'm thinking about the club head. Now, the grip should line your hands up with the club face so that you feel what the face is doing. But what I want to do is to swing the club head. Now, when we look at good golfers' swings, what we're really saying is the people who move the club head best through impact tend also to do this with their arms or their legs during the swing. What so many club golfers do is they get bogged down into thinking about their arms and legs. So they tend to think of the swing without the golf club. They think of the movements of the arms and the body, and they're thinking all the time of what is happening with their body, but they're not relating it to the club head. Now, what you need to do is to understand the club head. And what I'm trying to do is to swing it in the correct path away from and through the ball. So this is the thing that I'm concentrating on. And I'm swinging that club head in this way. I'm swinging the club head from here to here. That's the bit that interests me, is what the club head is doing. Now, one of the difficulties with golf is that we have a stationary ball. It allows us too much time to think what we're going to do. And so it's very easy to get obsessed with your arms and your legs and your body. If we think about tennis, what we're doing with this is moving the racket. I'm trying to move that racket head, and the racket head moves me. I've lined up my hand and the racket head, and I move the racket, and that moves my body. If we think about using a knife and fork, what we're doing is moving the knife and fork, and the knife and fork moves our bodies. So if I think of eating some food, what I'm doing is I'm using my fork and I'm using my knife, and I concentrate on them, and they move me. You don't have to think to yourself, now, if I'm going to eat this food, I've got to lift this arm, move it out, bend the wrist, and at the same time, think of this arm doing this. You don't concentrate on your body, you concentrate on the implements, and they move you. Now, that's how you need to get with a golf club. You need to understand that the movement of the club should really move your body. Your body moves in sympathy with the club. Right, now, what I'm doing is I'm thinking of the club, and I'm thinking of the club face, and I'm trying to move the club away in a certain position here, and I'm conscious of where the club head is all the time. I know exactly where the club head is, I know exactly where the club face is, and as I come through, again, I know exactly what it is doing, and it's moving me. Remember that you can have the best golf swing in the world thinking about your body and your arms, and it won't make the club do the right thing. So try and make friends with your golf club.